Listen, LeJarrius Sneed is a titan. Yep. Yeah. And LeJarrius Sneed did not go for a lot. No. LeJarrius no. Sneed got traded for next to nothing, but he got a big time deal. So congrats to Rand Carthon and everybody down in Tennessee getting a great corner who obviously saved the AFC Championship for the Kansas mm -hmm. City Chiefs with a precise peanut punch, which caused the fumble at the half yard line. It is a 2025 third round pick um, and a 2024 seventh round pick flop. And then a new contract for Snead. So if you're going to get a top-end corner, you're going to have to pay him anyways. Mm -hmm. And where are you going to have to give up in the draft? Nothing, seemingly. Kansas City Chiefs, I guess, just couldn't get a deal done because they did franchise tag him. Could have franchise tagged Chris Jones. They ended up getting a deal done with him anyway. So weird scenario. I guess the Colts were in on it. Mm -hmm. Ooh. $55 million guaranteed. I think we could have afforded. Uh, instead, he goes to the AFC South, which I'm not necessarily yeah. thrilled about. But good for him getting paid. I think that's good news for Snead. Yeah, fantastic. And the Titans casually are very good at football now. Like, Make a move. Like, if Will Levis is good, and I feel like we all saw some flashes, like that Miami game where he came back down 14 in the fourth quarter. Like, if he is good, there's a chance that the Colts are last place again in the AFC South for the next 10 years. I, like What? <laughs> what? Well, at the end of that. I didn't catch anything. What did he say? I, I was getting some news there. You talk about the Colts being last place? I'm saying there's a chance when you look around the oh, division of no. how everybody got. Oh, shut up, Foxy. Oh, oh, no. oh shut better. up, Foxy. I don't like hearing that at all. What uh, are you saying? You know what the Titans did? Like, I feel Colts like, about to win the AC South. I don't, Let's did, make sure that's understood. They're did, the running for sure. The top four at least. But you know what this did in the last couple There's of only four teams in the division. Oh, I'm saying the might, whole top four thing doesn't. I thought it might have changed. That's not. Uh, top two, but a few not weeks two. ago, we're like, are the Titans going to be the laughing stock of the AFC? And that what they did in the last few weeks is they at least changed that in a, perception wise before the season started. Adding Ridley, adding Snead. Like, those are two of the. They were two of the biggest free agents out there. For sure. And they seemingly have a plan, which <laughs> yeah. congrats to them. Callahan coming in with his dad, who's like the best offensive line yeah. coach in yep. the NFL. I mean, yeah. they have a plan. They're going to execute it. Good luck to them, and congrats to Nashville getting a new stadium upgrade yep. yeah. mm -hmm. and a brand-new face and a brand-new team, seemingly, that is doing very well, bringing in some stars. Jeff, the uh, big news this weekend, Legereus Sneed traded from the Chiefs to the Titans for a seventh-round swap this year and a third-round pick next year. Were the Titans always the front runners, um, and were any other teams? Teams gonna be in there towards the end that maybe made a late push to get him and also what are the specifics of the contract because the money's been reported as 19 per year 55 guaranteed is it in that ballpark or is that still being settled yeah I, I expect it to be right in that ballpark again he was going through the physical today uh if and when he passes that physical which I expect him oh no Tepper just shut that down. Yeah, yep. Do you see? That's the power Around Tepper that, has. You know, oh, he's back. It, 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 yeah, he's, I expect that physical to happen today. I expect he passes. I expect the deal to be formalized, the contract to be formalized, and that'll get done roughly at roughly $19 million per year. Now, again, the Titans were the team that was trying to make it happen. Here's the play that he made in the playoff game, which was as big a play as the Chiefs had in the postseason. Yeah. Obviously, he helped save that game in Baltimore and yeah. propelled them. To the Super Bowl, and they did speak to other teams. Like they, there were conversations at one point, briefly with the Vikings. There may have been a mm -hmm. brief conversation with the Colts. Although Pat, like I, I, I told you, yeah, you again, both sides told me that Captain that never Cole. went anywhere. It him. never went anywhere. Yeah. I don't think. Well, I don't think Jerry Sneed to Indy was ever a real okay. viable we did option it! ever. Amen. We did Sorry. it. Jeez, so Tennessee, Sorry. Tennessee was the Amen. team that was in on him all along. Tennessee was the team that was in on them all along, and that's ultimately where he's going to wind up once he passes this physical today. Okay, 19 mil and what a, wa a washer machine. Yeah, that's that's it. what it took to get him, yep. right? Well, you know, here's the thing, is, is that the Chiefs weren't entirely comfortable paying him, and they needed the salary cap space back, and the best offer they could get was the 2005 third round, 2025 third-round pick. And so, that again, you don't want to lose a player as great as LeJarry Snee, but they felt like they had to do this. Why'd they tag him then? You know, there's a whole lot of – did they think – Well, you tag him. You tag him because there's value. You don't want him just to walk out the door and you feel like you can get something back for him. Got it. So, a third rounder. Uh, yeah. yeah, well, that, that, that's that's what you get. Plus, there's you know, if they're signing for agents, you can wipe out the compensatory formula. So th they felt like it was in their best interest to tag him, preserve his rights, and then obviously they work – 
out a trade with Tennessee to get him. We'll pick up a second there. or a first for this guy. Yeah. Hey, no problem at all. Uh, third next year. And then a swap and a seventh. Okay, let's years. do it. Let's yeah. do it. It's just like the Chicago Bears with Justin Fields. You know how that thing went from, what was Mel yeah. Piper saying? Real quick. Uh, eighth, eighth overall, overall pick. Eighth overall pick, potentially. He wasn't the only one that was thinking that. But his clip is obviously going. Yeah. And then now it's obviously next year six. 